to the east. That would be behind you. Mike is rising a pneumatic pole. That operates off compressed air and is manned by two seals. Seals use various types of climbing poles. We pull alongside a target ship that is underway to allow us to get our caving ladder and hook over the rail of a target ship and gain access to take down the vessel, gain control. Mike will climb the ladder up the side of the ship and the climbing wall is representing the side of the ship. Chad will be behind him. As you can see, this is a very difficult strength and determination to get up 30 feet and over the side of a ship when you could possibly have bad guys like on the Alabama MERS, Captain Phillips. When Mike reaches the top, he will withdraw his pistol before he comes over the rail to make sure that he is ready to fight just in case. Once he gets over top, he will secure a safety runner just in case. If you can imagine you're in a pitching sea, the boat's going 12 to 15 miles an hour forward speed. You're on a rocking boat trying to get on this ship. It could be very difficult. Another method we use is called fast roping. This is used from helicopters like Hueys, MH-60s, CH-47s, and Marine Corps Ospreys and can be executed from different heights depending on the obstacles on the target like power lines and trees. Today, Mike and Chad are doing a 30-foot fast rope from our tower simulating a helicopter exit and insertion to the target. Similar to a fireman's pole, it's a simple maneuver to slide down, but you have to keep in mind they are fully loaded for combat with over 45 pounds of gear and other special equipment. Next we have Sean. Sean will demonstrate repelling, and again, this technique is used for multiple air platforms similar to fast roping. Repelling is a little bit more time consuming and hence more dangerous with time on station, including increasing risk to force, risk to mission. Used primarily to insert into thick jungle or high trees. We dedicated our Navy SEAL K-9 Memorial this morning. SEALs have been and continue using canines from Vietnam to present day. Today we have Raven, our Navy SEAL Museum K-9. Raven is a six-year-old Belgian Malinois Shepherd mix and is one of two of the museum's canines. Gonna do a zip line. How about that for Raven? Good job, Raven. Get up, bad guy, Raven.
I think he enjoyed that. But as you can tell, he is ready to eat somebody. See, I have many missions.